Alright guys, it is time to take on the final boss. And this is going to be, I'm going to split this and the ending into three parts, so I won't talk during this cutscene. Hmm. It appears I miscalculated the odds of your ability to escape that trap. You are, however, too late. Eden was activated as soon as I entered this room. It cannot be deactivated as long as I, the master key of this island, remain here in this control room. All that remains now is to wait for Eden to enter transmission range and send the command to execute the reinitialization of this island. Once that command is received, the 10,000 workers aboard Eden will execute it immediately. My estimates indicate their work will be completed in less than five minutes. That's not good. That's not good at all. A giant, uh, obelisk thing? Now that Eden has been activated, any further interference from you will remain on file, thus tarnishing my operating record. Fortunately, you are suffering from memory loss and fragmentation. Therefore, as keeper of this island, I hereby exercise my prerogative of correctional distance and Prerogative of correctional? What? Allow me to rephrase. I will exercise my authority to terminate your program. Alright, well, here we go. And this fight is so messed up. You'll see all kinds of glitches and crazy stuff happens fight. Uh, the main one is, well, some of his, I guess his attacks are invisible thanks to the stupid emulator. And kind of like that, you can only see part of it. This guy's nuts. Ow. Uh. Uh, here we go, invisible attack, invisible attack. Ow. Ready? And it gets even worse. Really, it's more like I'm fighting the the glitch more than the boss itself here. You'll see. I almost got him, but well, yeah, more is to come. There, we got him. My my. It would appear that I have made an error. Yeah, you've made a big error. No! You were nearly successful in terminating my life support subroutine function. But do not be disappointed. It appears it will take longer than anticipated for Eden to reach its optimal altitude. If you can terminate me before then, you will be able to stop it. Assuming you are capable of deactivating me. What? Now here comes the real final boss. Like, oh my god, look at that. Ah, yeah, the stupid Windows update thing got in the way. Are you ready? See what I mean? Everything is out to try and try and keep me from beating this boss. And yeah, you can see my cursor that I didn't notice at first was there. Ow. I actually have to heal. 
Ah, see? Glitch. Glitch. Uh, but thank God it didn't actually... It's not a game break glitch. See, you can't even see half of his attacks. Dumb emulator. I wish I was playing a console version of this, but... Oh well, you gotta do what you got. Thankfully, I got the active buster and... This happens again. Dang you. Come on, I almost got him. Uh, another invisible attack. Not good. Ow. Freaking. What the? Invisible attack. It's not exactly easy to dodge things you can't see. But I won. Oh, thank you, I won. And now for a big cutscene, I'm going to have to split in a couple parts, so... Yeah, you did! It appears I was in error, assuming that a bureaucratic model such as myself would be able to best you in hand-to-hand -hand combat. However, I was successful in keeping you occupied long enough for Eden to achieve optimal altitude before you could interfere. Uh-oh. This is Mega Man Juno, bureaucratic model third class, authorization number 8677. Requesting a reinitialization of this island systems and a memory backup of its bureaucratic systems. Stop! Stop it! If you wish to shoot me, please do not hesitate. My program has already been backed up in Eden's central core. I eagerly await my next. Act. Dip. Jean.